sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment down below. And make sure you guys turn on notifications by clicking that bell icon as well. Now, ABC News calls police on pro-Trump female college student who posed with a handgun. ABC News called Chattanooga police about a pro-Trump college woman who posted a photo of herself with a handgun. The woman, a 22, who was 22-year-old Brianna Spencer, a senior at the University of Tennessee Chattanooga, is shown in, her fo in the photo with her pink Women for Trump shirt lifted to reveal a handgun tucked in the waistband of her white jeans. Spencer, Spencer captioned the photo, I don't take normal college graduation photos. Spencer later explained how she posed with the gun. She said, I am wearing a belly band. I pulled my gun out further so it could be seen better for those of you who are so concerned. Now, it is in its report on Spencer, ABC noted that they called the police on her. The Chattanooga Police Department did not immediately respond to requests for comment. ABC spoke with Spencer about the photo and her observance of Carrie Laws. Spencer received several responses alleging that she broke the law by having her weapon unconcealed at the museum with one Twitter user including a screenshot of an article from ArtNews.com which lists the Hunter Museum among galleries that prohibit handguns inside. Spencer's friend took the photo outside the Hunter Museum of American Art in Chattanooga, but she did not enter the facility with her handgun and therefore, and therefore did not go through any kind of museum security, she told ABC. I know the Tennessee State Gun Code, Spencer, who is set to graduate in May with a major in communications and a minor in political science, said the Chattanooga Police Department did not immediately respond to requests for comment. Spencer, who works as a field representative for the conservative nonprofit Turning Point, says she owns several handguns in addition to one, the one that she featured, which she has owned for about six months. I carry everywhere that I am allowed to carry, she said, which excludes her college campus. Now, Spencer explained herself to a critic who claims to be pro-Second Amendment. Because I'm proud of my Second Amendment right and I want to empower other women, absolutely they are tools, but I will always brag about being able to carry a gun to protect myself, my friends, and my family. So be sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment down below. And tell me how you feel about this report and the fact that ABC News actually called the police on her. But uh, other than that, I hope you guys have a great day. Let's make America great again. Peace.